Good morning, good afternoon, everybody. My name is Becky the Fly, and welcome back to Auto War. Dude, it's been a while we've seen this game. Yeah, we basically just got good. We got a bunch got a basic radio you want to space, and I gotta do some side mission. But, in the bus side, I got the new hammer. So, yeah, I've been calling this baby meal meal. Yeah, from Thor. Anyway, we just fight your nose. Yeah. All systems are operating Go. within acceptable parameters. I am prepared to bring the unreliable into low altitude orbit. This should prove an adequate test of our flight capabilities. Okay. I can't get to leave this planet again. I still don't know about my decision last time to give the people who were. Yeah, I think I should have gave it to the other people. I don't know why. I feel stupid. I do feel bad about that. Next time, I probably would just do that and just give it to them. But who knows? Who knows? <laughs> we have received a communication request from Dr. Phineas Wells. Okay, go ahead, pick it up. Aha, there you are. Hale and hearty and captain of your own ship. Yeah, I know. I see you're putting the unreliable to good use. Shame about her former captain. Horrible way to die. Yeah. So. How are you feeling, by the way? I lost track of you in that cave back there. Experiencing any uh, unnatural drippage? Perfectly normal side effect of thawing. I assure Wait, you. Drip it from where? What you saw in Emerald Vale is happening all across the colony. Food shortages, lack of supplies, and basic necessities. We're dying. The chairman, the minister, and all their lackeys on the board are to blame. The Hope has some of the brightest minds Earth ever sent us. If we can revive the Hope's colonists, they can help us undo the board's mistakes. They can help us set things right. You need to get to Stellar Bay on Monarch. I have contacts there. They'll help me, help us, find the chemicals to revive your fellow colonists. Gladys okay. Kelly, lovely woman, runs a cozy little black marketing outfit on the ground breaker. She can get you a nav key to land on Stellar Bay. Excellent. I'll send okay. her a wireless. Let her know you're coming. By the way, I gave Captain Hawthorne a disguise apparatus of my own design. Cutting-edge technology, years ahead of its time. I call it the Holographic Shroud. I'm sure it will prove remarkably useful to you. You'll find it in the Captain's quarters. Are you got it, Shroud? Yeah, what is that? Marvelous device. I'm quite proud of myself. The Shroud changes the user's appearance to mimic that of another. It has limits. Yeah, okay. First generation mm, technology. You see. But promising. Exciting to see it in use at last. Very simply, the holographic shroud uses biometric information contained on standard identity cartridges to generate a holographic projection around you. Wait, do do you make me a visible or only stands up to a casual scrutiny. Use it too long, bound to flicker, blur, something like that. Movement makes it more likely. Best used in moderation. When you see guards in your path, you can't sneak past, for example. Mm. Maintain your distance. Act normal. No running, no jumping. Don't draw their attention. If they pay okay. attention, they're more likely to notice flaws in the hologram. Note it. So don't run, don't jump, don't make myself look like a maniac. Got it. <laughs> a change of clothes. What is this? Some old spy serial? What inattentive and brainless guard would be fooled by such a shabby disguise? Well, 
You oh, be surprised. The masks not only your clothes, but your face and fingerprints. It modulates your voice and sweetens your breath. No. Oh. Wait, you did my best things? Excellent. I'll contact you once you've found a way to get to Stellar Bay. If you have any questions, come see me in my lab. Wait, and where you lab? Don't trust the board. Oh, wait, I think that's it. I think that's Promises of wealth and power, but it's a lie. The board's only interested in filling their own pockets. If we don't put a stop to them, they're going to run this colony to the ground. Transmission ended. Mm. If you are ready to depart, please select a destination on your navigation terminal. Oh boy, okay then. Let's go. Where am I navigating the terminal? Is this thing right here? Right, computer lady? Thank you, okay, I got to say that. No, one button. Okay. Oh boy, okay, the this here. Is this where, uh, the this where I need to go? Okay, I just left this planet. Okay, I'm going over here, or, or am I going over here? I'm going with the green light thing is, though. Huh. I wanna know, I wanna know is it gonna be like more bandits or is this the it? I'm, I'm kinda good about that. But no time to figure that stuff out. Let's go! Okay. Okay, girl, you ready to go? Before I do my thing, let me go and get that Inferno Cloak. That's the whatever this thing is. Is it right here? It is! Okay, then how do I use it, baby? Do I... How do I equip it? Okay, got all my weapons here. What happened? Well, let's see. How, how do I equip this thing? Okay, see how my mission is. See, all the side mission is done that it happened. So hopefully I don't... Oh, this is her! Shoot, I didn't even know I could... Get full of weapons and tools and all that stuff. Okay. okay. Oh, let's do it here. Yeah, you that gun. I think you got that. Oh shit, I think I just messed it all up. Oh, I could retain, I could retain her clothes. Oh, yeah, no, I mean, I hate better than him to what I'm... Oh shit, okay. Okay. But I wanna know how do I use the incredible cloak thing. How do I do I already got the thing uh, equip? I think I okay, I'm gonna assume I have it equip. Maybe not. Okay, I can. Okay, this is my box to put the thing. I don't need to pick up no swords. Who use swords in space? And that is a lightsaber? No, thank you. Ready to come? 
Hey, Captain? Yes? I heard that Groundbreaker's got a real good engineer. A lady named June Lay Tennyson? Yeah. I was thinking that maybe I ought to meet her. If you got time to swing us by, I mean. I don't got much experience fixing actual spaceships. I bet you a can of Borston beans she could teach me all manner of stuff. Uh... Thanks, Captain. I'll be sure to make it worth your time. Did you want to talk about something else? Oh, um... No. Come on, let's go. Well, yeah, I guess we can do that. Yeah, I think go with me. Fine, I get you. I don't get it. Who else can be on my team? And how many people can I have on my ship? You know, guy, I am... So give it there. I'm gonna I'm gonna build the team up. We're gonna be like we're gonna be the next guardian of the galaxy up in here. We're gonna get a Rocky, Groot, Gamora, and Drax. We're gonna get all those people. No, no, we're gonna be better than them. We're gonna be called Guardian of the Galaxy too. Shut up, I no 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 no. I can come over one but um, the space no that's Guardian of the Galaxy too. Shut up! You're going to definitely work. Ooh, I'm so excited! I want to know what other band I get to see and live on. Captain. Hey, Captain. I'm in space. Yes. I never thought I'd be able to say that. You and me, Boko. Okay, the Biko. Biko, we got the the Biko. Walk with me, man. Walk with. They gotta be cool. Okay, my map let me, huh? Not that big, but they they can eat a sip. Okay, the be cool, be cool. We got it. We come. What's up, B? How you doing? Yeah. Oh no, that'll be stealing. Not that I'm stealing nothing. Again, not a thief. Me? Ooh, nah, I'm no Customs thief. And inspection, right this way. Me? Oh, okay, yeah. Identification, please. Okay. Do I got one? Captain Hawthorne, you said. Yeah. Let me apologize in advance. I'm about to ruin your day. Why? According to your ship's record, you've been flagged by the board. Your ship will be impounded until such a time as they see fit to lift it. What? Well, but we've hardly been out of Edgewater long enough to get in trouble. What do we do? Now, hold on, this isn't the end of the world. Probably. Probably. Yeah. You'll want to take it up with yeah, Udom Bedford, our board representative here on Groundbreaker. His office is located along the starboard wall of the promenade. Shines like a Byzantium commode. You can't miss it. Access to that information is above my pay grade, and I've turned down three promotions, so it stays that way. I shouldn't Why? be mentioning it, but what the hell? This here, impounding your ship, it doesn't happen much. The board knows we don't take kindly to their interfering in our operations. If I had to take a guess as to why, you must have riled up someone important. <laughs> Me? I would never do that. Not gonna lie, you're in a pickle. But uh, Udom's an uh, interesting guy. Might be y'all could come to accords if you play your cards right. <laughs> huh. Records show this ain't the first time your ship's been impounded. They yeah. have. to get cleared up pretty quick. You might not be in this pickle for long. I mean, oh, of course. If you're that way, would you mind doing me a favor? What's up? Sure. Wanda Dorset over in Sick Bay. Tell her the shipment's not in yet. It's not coming in anytime soon, and if she'd be so obliged to get off my ass about it. Ooh, okay. Got it. Much appreciated. Thank you! Is there anything else I can help you with? No, you have been dead to life. Okay. Be seeing you. I'll probably ask you a question later. So, yeah, I guess. Oh. Um. Okay, then let's go. Oh, 
about this thing? I picked up this weird signal the other oh. day. It was coming from the monarch. We got another ID just in case. Oh, I'm gonna get up by a sick bay right now. Am I going in the right way? I think I do not think I'm going the right way. Is Halcyon noon? We interrupt your regularly scheduled. I'm that guy. Like no honey, no honey. That take off my supplies. Wait, how do I get over there? Oh, Moon Man! Oh, what's up, Moon Man? That's a that's a face of the game. Again. The game feel like Fallout, that in space. Space out? Oh, you might be a girl in sick bay. You here for a particular reason? Or did the neighbors tell you how good my sugar cookies are? Made without a single natural ingredient or an oven. Just Wait, like store bought. Huh? How is that possible? Those have been the height of illegality since Stellar Bay turned their noses up at the board. You and I could be thrown to the void just for discussing such a transaction. Lucky for us, Groundbreaker's a free port. We're outside of the board's control. For the time being, at least. Now, I only have the one nav key. And they're hard to come by these days. It won't be cheap. If you find yourself lacking in the bits, I might have an opportunity you'd be interested in. Hmm, God. I don't have enough. Well, me. I find I'm in need of a ship captain with a little moral flexibility. Moral flexibility. Might be this could help out the groundbreaker, as well as earn some bits. But if you've got qualms, uh, moral flexibility. I uh, have flexible here. No, no, no. I am a good guy. No. Do you know Edna over in engineering? Sweet as a pea, that one. On occasion, she'll pass along transmissions I might find interesting. She sent me a recording of a distress signal she'd scraped from the Groundbreaker's comm array. Curious thing is, it came from an outpost called Roseway. And Auntie Cleo abandoned that place years ago. You've got an ear for intrigue and a nose for bits. I like that. Here's a copy of the SOS recording, complete with the coordinates. If you should find a secret worth selling, might be I could find a buyer. Hmm. Corporate bigwigs will pay top bit for inside information on their competitors. The more we got the corpse fighting each other, the less time they got to meddle in our affairs. I don't know how don't I feel about all of this. Gladys when you're done. Okay. I found a handsome ceramic manda pillar at a salvage auction last week. Hmm. Oh, did it hit? Oh, okay. So you got food. Let's see. Do you got any? Oh, that sale. You got any weapons? Oh, this gun is pretty good. Everything else I can't buy, but ooh. okay, no, I'll buy it. <laughs> I probably gotta sell some things. Um, I sell the hot sauce or whatever it is. Uh, okay, I can sell the not uh, uh, anything. No, I tell you, not again. I always got here saying, don't sell everything that they is one hundred percent useless. Then I really don't know what this stuff is. I know this is food, or this might be for my health. I can sell this, cause I'm not gonna do it. Oh yeah, that's my laser battle. I can sell this. And... Oh, cause I can sell that. I got a lot of swords. Okay, I can sell them a DD. Okay. Okay, that's to be it then. Thank you. All right, see your damage. I gotta go over there and talk to her. It's almost time for today. Oh no, I oh, don't have. Yes, dearie. 
Oh, nah, am I? Any time, sweetheart. You know where to find me. Here, take a candy with you. Uh, thank you. Ooh, be a candy. Okay, if, before we do any mayhem for anyone, we gotta get our ship back to it. Let us do that first. Are you listening to me, Emperor? I let me take my messages. Now that I know what I'm doing, like always. So that's the side quest. I bet I got you I am not done. So these are all I may have been competing, so that's good to know. Okay, let's uh, go ahead and do our thing. Then we worry about Again, like I said, they get our ship first, and then we could do a bunch of side missions and stuff. Ah, yes. Wheeler messaged me you were coming. He must be the captain of the Unreliable. Yes, I am. That used to be helmed by one Alex Hawthorne. Is that me? And you are not he. Well, uh, I am. Has something happened to my favorite scruffy freelancer? Mm, make sure I sell him the two for lie. Do I lie or do I tell him? To, no, yeah, I'm gonna to tell him to. He dead. Oh no, this is terrible. Yeah, I am a good My guy. My dear friend, what devilry is this? Don't worry, I didn't it kill him. Miserable fever dream, am I trapped? I'm sorry for your loss. Oh, Alex, there were so many arguments we'd yet to have. Wait, what? He was my dearest friend. My only friend. You have his ship, you must know. That picture of us on the promenade, me hugging him, him wincing. I keep a copy beside my bed. Did he? Uh, uh, he did. Oh, that's just like him. Such a sentimental man. I Tell don't me, know. How did he die? Oh. No! How dreadful. Yeah. That was always Alex's greatest fear, you know. Devoured by those fiends. Becoming one with their... Their droppings. A fine predator. Fine. You're free to go. I've removed the impound order on this But before you go, I did have one request. Ugh, what is it? Alex promised to tell me the location of Phineas Wells. I'm sure you've seen his wanted posters all over the colony. Did Alex tell you where Wells might be? Oh. Anything at all? Well, Alex knew, or he said he did, and you have his ship. Maybe he kept some records around, or a conveniently placed note on his bedside table. That's... well... That's just terrible news. Law, oh, what am I going to do now? The board will have my head. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm sorry. This is terribly unprofessional of me. Is there anything else I might help you with? Ooh, I think I'd like to save my friend. Nope. Well, I guess now I'm free to do whatever? I guess. Uh, let me take my mission. Okay, I'm 
Can you feel to ever make it like it? Yeah. Can you go do that one? I guess I don't see why not. Are you listening to me? You can't get me out of there. Please don't make a scene, Doctor. And uh, go in here. I talk. am not. If you're here to better yourself, you'll have to wait. We're having a spot of trouble with our delivery service. Did he now? The mouth on that man. I swear his late mother'd be ashamed. Ah, but he must be referring bad. to Erion. Yeah. I'm sure the fool's gotten himself into another scrape. I'm beginning to wonder if I'm ever gonna get my service mechanicals at this rate. Sophie, mechanical? Our delivery man. A brave idiot with a penchant for getting himself delayed. Sometimes by dates, usually by bandits. Hmm. I'd be grateful if you'd spare the time. We need his delivery soon as yesterday. Oh, okay. Last he told me, that. he was taking a shortcut by Scylla, an asteroid in the Charybdis cluster. Uh, so no. That's where I'd start, were I the adventuring type. You look out, though. The place is probably crawling with outlaws. Okay. Oh, yeah, you got got to miss something, but not nothing important. We got a new guy named Felix. Felix. Looks like it's Meet everybody else you can see. But man, how we get that guy? He can he was kind of waiting on our ship. And yeah, that guy he was just waiting for a our ship and he did. I want to work for you. Oh. Yeah, I did okay. Now I die like a dumbass. God, I am a dumbass. Yeah, that all my bad. Like, do not me to dump off me, get myself killed like that. God, now we know. I thought for me this was a afterlife, so I thought this was. You know, that kind of gravity thing will protect me or something like that. But no, no, that was, that was my bad ability, though. Yeah, go figure. Go figure. Really? But before, fine, okay. That's it, Felix? Yeah. It will be our first mission with him, so hopefully he is not terrible. I did hopefully, but hey, we will find that out pretty soon, I guess. Ugh. No, I heard the next Xbox do not have the game loading time be this long, it is particularly. We do not need the loading time to be this long sometimes. I feel like the. No. My God, I would deal waiting. Yes, yeah, we are. My mother, I am sorry, everybody who gotta watch me. You got loading times. Okay, now, baby, let's do something smart. What happened to him? Looks like they started I don't know. Halfway. Why? Is he feel? Oh God, damn! He brought a big boy with him. Okay. Dude, oh, dude, he's no way to my heart. I got his electric field. Felix, I, I think I'm happy I bought you. What? So he's gonna be our heavy hitter. And everybody on the team? Excellent! They're gonna be fun. What do you think about that, Felix? Didn't I tell you? I'm secretly the chairman's orphan child, abandoned at birth in the back bays. You, you kidding me? Honestly, before you picked me up, I was living in the back bays. I spent my whole life up there, watching ships roll in and take off. 
I always wondered where my ship would come. I was what folks on the Groundbreaker call a stowaway. It means I was invisible. Life carried on for everybody else, but not for me. I had to make my own way. Oh, I'm sorry about that. Stowaways ain't free. We were just as trapped as anybody else. We didn't belong in the system, but we still had to live in it. We still had to play by the board's rules. Imagine spending your whole life looking out at the stars and knowing you could never aspire to be anything more than a box hauler. That's what it's like. Mm. Hauling boxes was about the only work I could find. Hated every second of it. Foreman and I never got on. Guy never liked me, always trying to get a rise out of me. But I keep my chin up, right? Be the bigger man, I tell myself. He's a spacer's chosen man, though. So when the Chosen beat my rangers the other night, my foreman comes swaggering up with his head full of boasting. That's when I broadsided him with a tossball stick. Yeah. Look, this was a long time coming. Guy thinks he can push me around because he's some sky-high foreman and I'm just a back bay's dock worker. Former dock worker, anyway. That's all in the past yeah. now. I'm over it. And he's in recovery, probably. Oh, I can do civilized. Proper civilized, too. Genuflecting and everything. I caught a real lucky break. If you hadn't picked me up, I'd still be back at the docks, waiting for the day my ship arrives. That's just crazy talk. You know we'd never have a problem. Thanks for listening, boss. Let's get going. Ah, the Felix. I like him already. I think he'd make a good addition to the team. Now, I don't remember what I got. Oh, yeah, I could control these guys. So, yeah, us. Right, I got my jungle whip. Hey, are you friends? He's not friends. He's not friends. I don't know why the sound off, oh, by the way. I don't know why. Oh, my mother. I'm so sorry. Yeah. Everyone all right? Yeah, I'm sorry about if the sound don't match up. I don't know why. I see, I don't know why you're doing that. Ugh, it's freaking annoying. But let's not talk about it though. Let us uh, annoy it. Hey, Is that thing evil? You didn't... Okay! Oh my mother! Oh my god, I'm sorry! What did I do? That don't get the middle nobody die. See, what did I do to these guys? I'm gonna do. Uh, give me that fair health. Easy. I thought I thought we made it gonna be on my side. You okay, dude? Tremendous work, friend. Here oh I was God. readying a daring maneuver, and you've come and saved me the trouble. Symptoms detected: elevated heart rate, dilated pupils, increased sweat production. Subject appears to be terrified. I'm not terrified, you bucket of bolts. That's victory sweat. Uh-huh, you got your PG pen to me, but, but yeah, they only. got it, that. Uh, wait, who's asking? Wanda didn't send you, did she? So it did. I swear, land on Groundbreaker even a moment tardy, and that busybody's already been up your ass an hour. You tell her these Automex are coming. 
and sending a hired stooge to rescue me from certain peril only furthers my delay. No offense. I'm taken. Magnificent. And do please give Wanda my chilliest regards. Whatever. I don't know why, but I always like him. He hilarious. Be them if we can see more of him. I think that. I really hope so, okay? He does a delight. He cocky, but we all know he does he does that uh, Ooh, something big. Ooh, do not have a help for that. So we keep on moving and let's go back to our main base and tell her the good news that we save her. Um, do you really, boy? I guess. I'm ah, sorry about that battle. It, uh, it took me a while to figure out how to do anything. I was not to figure out how to do the showdown time thing, what they do in Fallout. And. Yeah, I forgot that like day. It's been a while. Team? And nobody got her. So I got that win win all around. So, or did I find out my thing? Do not work on stuff that's not a robot, though. Yeah, if you're not a robot, you need to use this. So, thank God, been all that time building that thing was super helpful at that first level, but. Now I know, if I fight any robot, meal meal, and a weapon to go. If I fight anything else, man, I guess this thing could work on people quite well. I remember that too. It doesn't need an upgrade. Ooh, maybe I could find some upgrade, but I gotta know you could upgrade your weapons in the game too, so. I just need to upgrade meal meal a little bit, give it more of like a spit and sign, you know what I mean? That cook and drink. I don't know what I'm saying either. But I do know they they got. Oh, yeah. I told for some reason we got cows. Yes, I don't know. But we probably we should now. Uh... Let's see. Okay then. Oh, that was. Ooh. Oh, Four dude, hold on right here. Let me go ahead and put this stuff on me right now. Oh, boy. Freaking, you guys got armor on. Did, 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 did I always have. I can keep the. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. You got that badass. Okay, now. What you guys think, huh? Huh? Give it a five out of ten. No, it's a ten out of a thousand. I'm gonna do that. Let me see that ten out of ten. Now, what the heck is Felix? No, oh, see, what Felix? What the heck is? Oh, Sam. I don't know who Sam is. I don't even know we got this room. X Sam. Okay. Oh, there you go, Felix. Gee, do you think you fit another fit out of a couple of crew members? I'm excited now. Huh. Uh, a bathroom? Only one, so if we more than that one guy with a bathroom, I really gonna hate to see. Dang it, always go down the ladder. You're not Superman. Dude, you're not even Batman. Okay, you need something if we want to fix that up, but okay, I kind of like my ship you go in the one big fat circle when you really need it. Okay, let me just come down here. See, not easy, not picking my leg. Okay, then. Let's go back to let her know what up. I gotta do a bunny of space travel after of it kind of just like like this, you know. I, I feel I feel a little bit upset. Even Star Wars kind of did it a little bit better, but then again, I gotta like this one better because it's a uh, instant like with the here, you know, like not that that super long loading screen. 
If that woman come out, I said we got this super long roller screen to do with, so... We, may I get one, you got something nice to look at, kind of, and you got to explore the ship while you going. But... I think I prefer this way, at least. Because it, it might be better than you think. I am so sorry. You could uh, fire forward it. Go ahead, double tap your screen, or you know that fire forward. I bet it's not gonna take that long. <laughs> Ooh, man, I need five them to do. Ah, oh, thank God. Oh, I don't know how much entertaining. There we go. Okay, I got everything fixed now. Uh, yeah, we got everything fixed. Yeah, sorry about that. Um, um uh, my memory got too full, so I got to delete them. Delete them up, but uh, we all good now. No more problem now. Were I a gambling woman, I'd wager your response for my mechanical safe return. I can't thank you enough. Yes, I am. Oh, stop it, you. See, see, doing the right thing that make you, make you feel good, you know? Hmm, oh, I don't, not gonna worry about that, so let's see what I got there. Okay, I did everything that I completed. So, you got one to do one more side mission? Now, let's, uh, let's do this main mission real quick. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna do some kind of SOS mission for her? I never made that for a side mission or something, but I think that might be a main mission. Yeah, I think I need the money, Anytime, okay. Sweetheart. You know where to find me. But where do I got to go then? How do I do that? Huh? I believe I'm doing the way. Maybe I gotta talk to her some more. I have no idea. The time I wanted to be an engineer. Could spend all day. Oh yeah, no, they hit a minute for her because she wanted to talk to her. I'm captain around here, but chief to my friends. Hope you don't mind the formal introduction. Groundbreaker doesn't see many visitors. Uh, no problem at all. No, my name is Impact the Fire. Nice, but it's my mess, so I'll take the compliment. Just so we understand each other, I'm the final word on the ship. The Mardits, the crew, the engineers, okay. their family. I hope there won't be any problems while you're visiting. No problem for me. Good. Don't go making trouble, and chances are you won't find any. That's how I like it here. So what brings yeah. you to Groundbreaker? I'm curious, even though nine times out of ten, the answer's just passing through. <laughs> I hear that. The fucking through. Good. Right. Let's try and keep it that way. We see a lot of the same faces coming and going. Most of them board spies and corporate sprats. Makes it hard to trust outsiders. You seem different. Fair so enough. Aboard. Felix Milstone. Ah, oh, nice that's that. out of Docking Bay. Keeping your nose clean? Yes, ma'am. Been at least a couple weeks since my last nose related incident. Uh huh. I'm glad to see you in a captain's custody. Just try not to steal any critical parts from my ship. It's possible I got caught lifting some spare yeah. parts a couple years back. But it was only just that one time. Honest. I tell you to stay out of trouble, but I, I hope so. Find it anyway. Whatever you do, just make sure I don't find out. Oh, don't worry. If he get into trouble, I know how to get what? him out of it. I didn't think you just. Parvati, is it? That's a lovely name. What can I do for you? I was just thinking. I haven't got much experience working with actual real spaceships miss junlei uh uh chief oh, junlei Junle is fine 
Force of habit, I guess. Um, okay. Since you run a whole space station, I was wondering if... Well, maybe you could teach me some things. I could message you later, maybe? I'd be happy to make the time, Parvati. You can ask me anything. Right! In person. Sh sure thing, Captain. Wow, great! I I'll do that then. Messages. Later. Oh, your your name's pretty too. I should have said sorry. I like it. Honest. Sorry. Man, she do know it. Don't worry, Not you got problem, this. Captain. Ask away. Groundbreakers radiators need replacement parts. They're dumping superheated air into my ship. Only the board has access to new parts. And I won't let them swindle me into a corner. None. Oh, Dad, you Every need, time um... I give into the board, Groundbreaker loses its freedom. Soon there won't be anything left. I can't allow that. The board isn't helping, and my resources are spread thin. If I don't get those radiators back online, Groundbreaker, everyone aboard, will be cooked alive. Reasonable, huh? That's the best news I've heard all day. According to my grandmother's old schematics, the parts we need should be in the back bays. Hold on. There's something you should know before you go charging off. The back bays are on a lower deck, what long that? abandoned, and a haven for miscreants now. You must not have been here long. In Halcyon, new parts come by way of interstellar freighters from Earth, and the board monopolizes that kind of trade. That means I'd have to negotiate with the I board. love Monopoly. I've already given them the shops, the docking fees, and a damn embassy. Damn right. And while I'm captain of the Groundbreaker, it falls to me to preserve this ship's independence. Good. Once you've obtained the parts, we can proceed to the next phase of repairs. I am gonna... Help her fix her ship now. Okay, then I guess I'm gonna help her fix her ship. Let go! And I'm, again, Bobby need to find more job to. I, I, I need money to I could do that thing or bots. Do I buy a uh, do them? Yeah. Hopefully she will pay me. Again, I'm down to be a good guy, but I'm a good guy who need money, Joe. I need them that 16, 16. More he do move on with the mission. But it should be easy. Getting a later later bot or whatever. Man, the the dang government has done it already take Oh my god, I have to have a dead again. Man, I don't know what's up with me and dumping things off. Remind me of the tower game, frankly. But I do Me and bombs, again. Don't give me no bombs. Cause I will find a way to pull myself up with it. Seriously, I have no idea why. Yeah, in every single game I play, if you got bombs, I will pull myself up. I have no idea why. You gotta put it off, don't. Hey, remember that one time we gotta do the backups? For Yeah. I'm gonna do my best to forget that moment. Oh, in Fortnite. Where are we headed today, Captain? Ugh. The stars are the limit. Yeah, they are. So, June Lei and I have been talking Ooh. some. Through messages? I got him here on my data pad, and well, she sent me a poem. Okay. When she wrote her own self, I'm pretty sure. I don't know if I should read into it. Because poems are all symbolic and such, right? It's yeah. not so good. I guess. But real sweet. Uh, okay. Oh, law. That's what's got me spooked. I don't rightly know. It's about this engine that's been shaking itself apart. Then this lady mechanic comes by and lays one hand on it. The trouble goes away. It sings. I don't want to get too hopeful, but I'm wondering if 
Maybe she's the engine and I'm the lady? It's a real romantic poem. Oh. Made my chest hurt, kinda. Ah, I don't I bet know you, if you would do fine. If I'm misinterpreting, I'm not much interested in physical stuff. Good, give me that deep. Never have been. Least ways, not like other folks seem to be. It's not that I can't, I just don't care for it. It's been a problem in the past. The folk who wanted to be with me back in the Vale, they didn't. They said I was cold. You don't seem cold to me. No, sir. That's not it. I guess I just needed to talk. I'm feeling a touch better. Thanks for hearing me out, Captain. I actually had another message from Juno. Well, it might have to admit to. Couldn't work up the courage to open it. But I'm gonna change that. Uh, what is it? Right now. Okay. Go, Here we go. go ahead and open that letter. Let's, Let's see what he said. Talking about old friends, got to thinking... Isabel? Who's... Who's Isabel? No. Yeah. They were... Ex keep close, me. Captain. Like, more than friends close. Oh. I don't know. June Lay talked about them like it was past, but how far in the past? Ten years? Last week? Captain, I'm feeling all mixed up mm. right now. Could we... Maybe head to the Groundbreaker, get some drinks at that bar there. Lost Hope. Come on, Captain. Yeah, sure. There's no time to be fooling on me. I'm full serious. Next time we're on the Groundbreaker, I aim to get a drink. If I got to, I'll do it on my lonesome. But I'd feel better if someone I trusted was there. I think I picked up the. I think I did up the all there. I have no idea what I'm doing anymore. Uh, okay, we could leave him behind this time. Okay, they're gonna be me and her again. I think I should need somebody to talk to. She need a girlfriend to talk to, you know? Yeah, you guys know. I'm gonna be her girlfriend. Not like that, I mean, I'm gonna be her really good friend, I mean. Let her talk about her problem and stuff. I think I should gonna need it. Cause as a, as a captain, I'm going to Help everybody in my crew to deal with their problems and be their friend and that's to take all, you know. Make everybody okay, fizzy and emotionally. But it let the crew know you could always come and talk to me about anything, you know. That's who I'm gonna be in the game. If you guys have a problem, then come talk to me and if we could fix it, we could fix it. You know, cause I'm a, that's who I'm gonna be. So let's go ahead, let's go to a bar, let's talk to her, and make sure everything is okay with her, you know. See, I, I mean, I don't... Do, do far out that thing kind of party with your friend? I hope so. But for now, let's go ahead. Even though I feel I might get a one. I guess that I may... You probably won't drink, but hey, I, it, it's fine. work do we get a table okay. stand in a corner oh and don't worry on the price I got this let's just do it proper oh beer I guess yeah I can do that beer can be good I bet bottoms up Ah, this tastes like the underside of a boot. People drink that for fun? <laughs> oh, Captain. I'm pining for June like something fierce. What am I doing? Uh... Specifically. Definitely. Definitely specifically. Oh. Oh, why'd I drink that? I mean, just with June like I don't know what to do about us. Well, she talked Talk about another her. girl, right? Isabel. Mentioned her by name and everything, like she wanted me to know. Maybe I've been making a right fool of myself this whole time. Maybe she's not interested after all. I, 
don't know, I'd call it, uh, sensual. That's a lot. He did. Oh dear, I hadn't really... Oh my goodness. And I told you! It was real long and rambly. She was telling me a story about her dad. How a lady named Isabel did all sorts of things to try to win his favor. This Isabel lady never quite managed to get her dad's approval, but they carried on anyways. Made something good out of a bad situation. Then it all went down the tubes. Do you think Junlei still has feelings for her? Hmm. Hmm. Don't know. So, mm, I wouldn't say that. Maybe she might. But does she definitely into it in you? Well, maybe, maybe she age. just wanted to let me know her preferences. In a less awkward way. But that made it more awkward. I, I need another drink. Right now. Before I lose my nerve. Come on, Captain. I'm here to drink. Okay, maybe you're right. I am a little woozy. Hydration, here I come. <laughs> oh, Captain, I want to talk to Junlei all the time. Even about silly things, but oh, I'm so scared. Um, everything? I got a solar system's worth of terrifying questions swirling around my head. Does she think I'm as pretty as I think she's handsome? What if she doesn't like me? Mm. What if she does? What if she's still got feelings for that lady, Isabel? What if we we get together and I'm... she gets bored of me? Don't you tease me in my moment of weakness. You know I'm not interested in physical <laughs> affection. That's well, it's tripped folks up in the past. Folks I thought cared mm -hmm. about me for me. What if she's not okay with that? What if she is, but then later she's not? Okay, dear. Of course. Wouldn't you be? Huh. I'd never thought of it that way. I wonder what June's afraid of being rejected for. She seems perfect to me. Maybe those are just my rosish colored goggles talking. To be strong like her. Gosh, I don't know that I got that in me. Sometimes I feel real hey, pain inside. You are Captain. strong. I think ungenerous thoughts. I suppose so, but you know, I, I, I want to be my best self for her. A good person, worth caring for. Well, Captain, this has been... This has been a whole lot. I got just... Wow. So much to think about. Oh, gosh. I, I don't uh, know, you Captain. Do you out? think I should? All right. Yeah, I'll no need to strip your screws over it. Okay. I, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna ask June out. You better. Just as soon as we get back to the ship. Yeah. I mean, probably. Okay. Eventually. Thanks for hearing Gamma. me out and giving me counsel. And well, for no problem. It means a whole lot. You're good people, Captain. Oh, Liga. Come on, let's go. You could talk to me about anything. 
tea. Do you want to do the job? I could be there for my crew. If they have a problem, I want to be there to help them out. And we got, we can have to talk to you and me. They can back here and see if you can ask you little girlfriend. And I don't mean that apple friend, I mean her girlfriend. Your actual how on a date. I really hope it go well for her. Okay. I don't, I don't want to see her heart broken. Okay then, okay. I your Alex by... His name was Alex or Felix? Felix! There we go, I don't know why I call him Alex. But Felix over there. I wonder what he's doing over the ship. I really hope he is a good guy. Nah. Don't worry, going to do steal anything from me. But hey. We're not here to talk about him. We do, we do, we do. Damn it. We would... <sighs> If I ever caught every time I fuck up my line. <laughs> no, we will worry about him later, okay? This is all about the good thing. Damn it, why am I bad with names? Good, you're back. Not that I missed you. I assure you, I am not capable oh. of such emotional capacity. Oh, Dapper, you did. And I don't feel today. Okay, then. I guess that water must have worked. I'm glad I had you looking out for me. No problem. I wouldn't mind having a drink again. Someday. In the distant future. No problem. Anyway. Yeah. I messaged Junlei when we that, got back. Not she super quick. <clears throat> okay. Okay, what did you say? I was awake half the night thinking about what I sent. Anxious to see what you said. I reread my message in the morning and it was unclear. I was drinking when I sent it. Otherwise, I wouldn't have had the courage. Also, sorry for the typos. <laughs> I've ruined things okay, in the past okay. because I didn't say things I should have, like, I've met someone who's become special to me. I want to be honest with her, so if she feels the same about me, there won't be any surprises. Oh, isn't she sweet? Like one of those two-bit romances where yes. you're so little, stiff and formal, and I should be glad to perhaps take hold of your hand, miss. I ought to go write her back. I mean, I already did. Twice. <laughs> but anyhow, thanks for taking oh. me out, Captain. No problem. Thank you again. Got your help. Okay, then. We got that job that did not pay me, so... Okay. Uh, probably need something that would actually pay me. I hate it before. I, I think I'm gonna end this one off here. I have a die. Romance. Oh man, I don't know why I'm gonna call this episode, but I'm gonna call it something crazy like the um, outer world romance or something. I, I I don't know. I'm gonna figure out some kind of title because they got. I have to put some titles in the job. Whatever, whatever, okay. Anyway, this was... Well, we'll make it, okay. This is fine. Oh, by the way, I'm sorry I'm not talking to her again. If you watch my first video of this, I'm not gonna talk to her when people are talking. When people are talking, I'm probably gonna to shut up and think about what I'm gonna say or pick. Because they can feel like if you pick something stupid or wrong, yeah, if we're not talking to bite you in the butt, like, hard bite, like, that, mmm, like, you get my point. So, yeah, I'm gonna, that's why I'm not very talkative in that basic game. For some people, the, for some people that find that super happy about being thrown in a party, I did, and the only thing I did to throw people in, out, that, that hurt my feelings a little bit. But if not, you do want to hear me talk to more and, and compensate or and make jokes and stuff. Check out my other videos. That's my Guild of War 5 videos still. I'm still doing. Yeah, that can't be out for a while and I'm the fact like I'm the only person who haven't even beaten it. Yeah, but hey, that from nah, dying. We hear that about Atwood. Again, fun game. I recommend it to everybody who wants that far, that far feeling. Then, 
you know, Fallout 76. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they do have been not to talk about that. Oh, they talk about it. They make jokes about it. But that game is just a joke. Anyway, so yeah, next time you see me, gonna be doing more Good Old World 5. I don't know when I'm gonna get back to this game. Like, at all. But, hey, sometime. So yeah, anyway, let me end the fight. Let me end the video here before this video get any more longer. That's an hour again. Not time to do that. So yeah, um, if you guys laugh, or oh, find the video enjoyable, please take the video with your friend and family. And subscribe and hit that like button. And hit that bell notification when you keep up to date with me. And, yeah, I have no idea how to end this video, so... Bye. Bye. Goodbye.